suddenly a whole like machine gun fire started on us accurate machine gun fire like how chaos comes out of the darkness boom accurate fucking buddy this big motherfucking bullets coming at you so two seconds into that and uh, i just thought at that point of time that the man who stands now and returns fire he's the leader so i stood up and i started fucking firing back the indian special forces for someone who knows about the army it's considered okay this is like the most for lack of a better word badass part of the army and there's not much about that out there and i know it's going to change in the next 10 20 years sir but if the change had to begin with this question how would you introduce the indian special forces to the indian audiences special forces stand for efficiency it's the highest form of efficiency that a human being can achieve in this reality you send me naked in a mountain and you leave me there i'll get back mm. and i'll go and do what needs to be done because i've chosen that experience mm. so that's where the spirit comes from so 3 years in the nda and then one year in the ima and then after all of this intense amount of ragda that you get and you still choose for more right so it takes balls to fill in your volunteer form from the moment you land up at that gate from there onwards your life shifts all your paraphernalia of your ego and 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 your perceptions of yourself and all those things they dissolve in the amount of energy which is expended or you are exposed to it just shatters all that is around you and very quickly you are brought out from there you come to realize about yourself a lot what your body is capable of what your mind is capable of what your heart is capable of and what is there beyond when you give up when you when you just let it all go and you're hanging by that thread of choice because it's a choice you made so you're hanging by the thread of choice constantly there constantly there even if you know yamraj comes and stands in front of you you'll tell her fucking put a bullet in you man get the fuck out of my way you get through this process and from what i hear it's a lot about breaking the man breaking through all the layers getting to the core hmm. and the process of breaking those layers some people's cores break and those are the ones that leave and the ones who are left with that pure core they are, become more powerful well now you have realized yourself you know what you are hmm. you just look back at what you have gone through for this long period of time you know and then you realize that nothing is impossible nothing 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 do you feel that combat also continues your training process of course of course it's like a painter who has been painted mm. if a special forces soldier has you know you've gone through nda you've gone through ima you've gone through a lot of shit in life you go volunteered you got into uh, you know reached the battalion you know gates of hell <laughs> and you reached there and you've gone through a process of 6 months of bloody getting screwed up and this that and all that and and then you have not seen combat or you've seen very less of combat you are you're not there hmm. so i remember my first combat experience what happened i was sitting on top of a mountain uh, we had to go down and you know do what we had come there to do so i was supposed to sit with the radio set and listen <laughs> what my team commander told me you listen and learn that's what he told me you keep sitting there see what happens so i was sitting and waiting and then the two squads which were going down for the hit they were passing by just next to me yeah they were going down and i knew fucking they are going for combat right now they are going to experience right now and the last guy was going and i just told my buddy i am also going bye bye and i and i went down behind the last guy so i reached there and i informed my team one that sir i am here now so he said okay and obviously there is no extracting me back from there now because the contact is going to happen now right so he let it be it was my choice so and then first stop first contact first hit <laughs> that's how i experienced it i chose it There is no authority in combat. 
when the shit is flying and death is like constantly zipping around you like 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 like, like that there is no authority there is no captain major colonel brigadier freaking no one it's just you and the people who are there with you and what are you going to do right now that is what decides leadership there that is what either keeps it all together or everything is destroyed in all your missions you've not seen casualties to the extent where you know i don't think you've taken a bullet yourself or you've not no, had a no, bullet in you nothing nothing every fucking time chaos has hit right through that chaos uh never taken a bullet had enough of fucking bullets fired at me i've had sh- fucking weapons shoved in my face i got a fucking i've been surrounded by enemy i opened my hands like this and looked at him in the fucking eye and told him it's okay i've killed four like you okay kill me man fuck off right and then look beyond what is there to see what is there now to see it and experience it like my whole life flashed in front of me three times it has happened no whole life flash like that it's a flash it's beyond time there is no time it doesn't happen in a microsecond or a one second or a 10 seconds or whatever it just happens stuck so yes there have been a lot of out of control chaos which has come like that come suddenly come without warning and got out of it yeah <laughs>